Well, we're going to turn now to the high drama happening right now at the International Space Station. A dangerous spacewalk this morning to fix the crucial cooling system. And ABC's Mike Betcher has the latest on how the risky repairs going from inside the Johnson Space Center in Houston. Good morning to you, Mike. Well, good morning, Biana. I'm inside the mock-up of the International Space Station at the Johnson Space Center in Houston. And this is the airlock module that astronauts use to train for spacewalks and is the compartment they will enter the vacuum of space to fix their alien spacecraft. Fix a failed cooling system that keeps the space station functioning. A repair that NASA says cannot wait, despite concerns about another possible problem, a spacesuit failure. It sounds to me it's like doing a ballet with a washing machine. It's true. It's true. Where you're, I mean, it's got to be really, really graceful. Veteran American spacewalker Rick Mastracchio will be teamed with rookie Michael Hopkins during the delicate operation. We are inside the Quest airlock. Astronaut Quest Tracy airlock. Caldwell Dyson helped replace the same pump during three spacewalks three years ago. You've got this really important task, and when you realize that it's just the two of you out in the vacuum of space, yeah, your, your own breath becomes <laughs> um, something very loud inside your helmet. Complicating matters is the potential of water collecting in their space helmets, a problem that came close to drowning an Italian astronaut during a spacewalk last July. My head is really wet. NASA is not sure what is causing the problem, but in typical NASA fashion, engineers came up with two ingenious fixes an absorbent pad placed inside the helmet and a 20-inch plastic tube that would allow spacewalkers to breathe air from the bottom of their suits. Spacewalks only look easy. The anticipation of, of knowing what it feels like to actually be outside in the vacuum space, to have nothing between you and the Earth but your visor. At this moment, the astronauts are still in this space lock when they do walk, it could last up to seven hours and is the first of possibly three walks to repair their station. Dan? Mike Betcher inside the mock-up of the International Space Station. Mike, thank you.